Zach Hing is. Uh, it, it, I don't know, but is, is Zach, are you in ABC? What are you? He's in California. He's Chinese, I believe. Uh, he's an American citizen. And it's interesting. His situation is kind of flipped from me because I'm over here in Taiwan. I'm learning Mandarin. And it, it, there's, a, there's, a, there's a magical contrast between why immigrants go into America and why I'm over here in Asia. I, when I came over here to Asia, m my standard of living went down. And I didn't care because I came here because I wanted to learn about other cultures. I, 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 I value the wealth of the cultural exchange. I want to learn about other countries. I want to expand my knowledge. I want to practice and learn Mandarin because it's just awesome. And a lot, of, a lot of Americans are fascinated with Asian characters, Japanese, you know, whatever. They're, they're from a family and you can look that up. But I'm over here and I'm, I'm seeing what Zach does on his YouTube channel and it's inspiring to me. Sometimes I might not know what I want to talk about on the Taiwan special. And then I'll go watch one of Zach's videos and all of a sudden I've got stuff to talk about. Well, today Zach talked about it. The title was Illegal Immigration and Open Borders. Well, yesterday's, but this was the one that I decided to watch. And he explains the process of immigration, how his family went through that. Well, me, I've gone through that in Taiwan. And I don't have any status. I just kind of survived over in Taiwan as it, in a legal system that I've already established on YouTube is a third world legal system. There's just, there's a lot of lawlessness everywhere and the laws aren't even written as if they're expected to be obeyed. In fact, they kind of weren't when it was under the control of Chiang Kai-shek's political party, not even 20, 10 years ago, not, not even very, very recently. So I've been over surviving and people ask, you know, Jesse, you know, what have you accomplished in your life? Uh, I, I didn't just live in Asia 10 years. I survived that grab legal system 10 years. And not once was I ever illegal. Because, you, you know, there's this talk about, you know, just let, let anyone they want, just walk over the border, come on in and do whatever you want. And if you kill people and we send you out of the country, that's really mean. I mean, the stuff that the leftist activists object to, just like Zach said, the stuff they object to is you know, stopping a criminal from beating people. It's like if you've got a, if, if you've got a white male in America and he punches someone, when we're going to fry him alive. But if you've got a Mexican that comes into the country, wa runs, walks over the border, sells drugs to your kids, and then does a lot of bad, naughty things to 20 different girls and then runs over five people with a car and we deport him, oh, well, all of a sudden we're mean. That's what people complain about. I, I think when people complain about these problems in America, they don't know the backstory of what they're complaining about. And I, so Zach, my hat is off to you, my friend. You can see my receding hairline. How you're so patient in how you explain this, Zach. See, I, you know, you had this walk away thing. And for me, I, I never walked away, which I've explained later. So my perspective as, as an immigrant in Asia is cultural. And I just think it's kind of fascinating because I've been over here and I've seen these problems and, and I've, I've written Congress about the third world legal system that I've seen happening in Taiwan. Like I've tried to explain uh, you know, problems that I've seen it. But for me, I just kind of want to stay in Asia and, and, and do the best I can to learn what I can from everything and anything in Asia that can help me become just a better person. And also, like, I help people around me with little pointers and tips on English or how American culture really works so that we're able to kind of get past those differences that lead to confusion. And I want to do things that, that clarify. I mean, I, there's an American over here. He's a, he would be a, a TBA, a Taiwanese born American. Actually, he's a Taiwanese born Korean American. A really, really amazing story how, how the world is getting to be a small place. And I'll, I'll roll you and I'll, I'll give this guy free English lessons just because here's an American. He doesn't know English very well anyway. And I, I just want to help him. His English is getting awesome recently because he's got a great English teacher. Well, that's, that's, the, uh, that's the Taiwan special for today. It's a very, very short, but I'm, I'm, really, I'm really inspired by Zach Hing's YouTube channel and what he's doing and how fast it's grown. And... I, I really, I get him because I'm, I'm the flip of, of what, what he's been. And there are a lot of differences in culture that we would understand. 
And if you're not a subscriber to Zach's channel, you need to be. So go check that out. Link is going to be in the description.